Hey guys, it's Nikki Jabor for Johnny Selected Seeds, and today I'm going to sow Ace Peppers. This is a bell pepper that's extra early, very productive, and perfect for short season gardens like mine. When sowing peppers indoors, timing is important. Start them about eight weeks before your last expected spring frost and plant the seeds just a quarter of an inch deep in a soilless potting mix. The key to great pepper germination is heat. So place your pots or flats in a room that's 80 to 90 degrees Fahrenheit or 26 to 32 degrees Celsius, or place them on top of a heating mat. Once the seeds have germinated, average room temperature is fine. Once the last frost date has passed, harden off and move your pepper plants to the garden. I plant them 12 to 18 inches apart and I use a tomato cage to support their growth. I've got a lot of peppers planted in my polytunnel, on my sunny back deck, and in my raised bed vegetable garden. I'm growing sweet peppers like Ace and hot peppers like Red Ember and Jedi. And while peppers are generally trouble-free plants, they can be bothered by pests like aphids or flea beetles. And for aphids, I just knock them off the plants with a jet of water from my hose. And for flea beetles, I use row covers early in the season to help prevent damage. When my pepper seedlings are young, I do pinch them back so they'll branch out and give me plenty of peppers to harvest. Don't over fertilize your pepper plants. Too much fertilizer, especially high in nitrogen, can encourage plenty of beautiful leaves, but very few flowers and fruit. So if you do fertilize, make sure you choose a fertilizer for fruiting vegetable plants. When the weather is really challenging, very hot or cold, very wet or dry, pepper plants can drop their blossoms. Growing a variety that's tolerant of blossom drop, like Ace Pepper, is a great way to ensure you get a good harvest. Sweet peppers can be harvested when immature or when they've ripened to their beautiful mature color. Now this is Ace and it matures to a red. Some are yellow, some are orange, some are even purple. So there's quite a few different types of bell peppers out there. So read your seed packet carefully so you know what the mature color will be. But again, you can also harvest them when still green. Jalapenos like Jedi are super easy to grow and really productive. Most of these fruits are harvested when they're green like this, but if you leave the jalapeno fruits on the plant, they'll ripen to a bright red, and at that point they're both spicier and sweeter. When harvesting peppers, don't just tug or yank the fruits from the plant, as you can break the stems or an entire branch. Instead, with this ace pepper, I clipped it here with garden shears, as you can see, and the same with my Jedi jalapeno. It's much easier on the plant. Peppers like red ember should be harvested when their fruits have reached that nice red mature color. And you can enjoy them fresh or you can dry them to add spice to your winter meals.